Hey, welcome back to the Dales. There's mist all around, but I do believe the sun is trying to get out. <laughs> Wuthering Heights country. Well, uh, I thought I'd get an hour or two in while I can. And look what I start off with. How is that for a buckle? <laughs> oh my goodness, if things carry on like this, I'm going to have a really good day. Whoa, what a buckle. Sounded like a tin can lid, you know? Whoa, 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 whoa. Beauty. I'm not sure if that's a coin or a button. Gonna have to wait till it cleans up. Oh, this fog is cold on the ears. <laughs> hey Lee, I should have brought that hand warmer you sent me. <laughs> Fingers have folded off. Oh, I was despairing of getting anything in this field here. <laughs> I haven't had anything in this field. And then, boom, boom, I get myself a nice buckle. <sighs> Good one. I've been working in uh, TX3 with that extra power. And it, it's just, it's just given me loads of erroneous readings. So I've gone back to two, the uh, default setting. Hey, two nice big buckles. Oh, the sun's come out. <laughs> My ears are still falling off. Hey, look, I got myself a tiny coin ball. Very tiny. It's got to be a button. Uh, oh, what are you? Let me just check on this. Yep, it's still in there. Oh, there it is. <laughs> yes, as I suspected, a tiny button look. <laughs> My goodness, good signal down deep. A miniature horse brass, tiny little shield. It's got one, two, two spikes for holding it on. Hey, hey. <laughs> Well, I got a coin. Not sure what it is. It's uh, very, very, very um, blackened. We'll see when we get home. Hey, look, a compulsory iron ring. <laughs> oh, can you hear that wind? It is pulling in cold. Brr. Gold doors and gold fingers. <laughs> Just going to follow this footpath down the road and then I'm off. But uh, we got 50p. Oh well. Hello, welcome to the roundup. It was cold out there today. <laughs> Brrr, freezing fog. Sun came out a bit, then the wind came up. No, my God, it was cold. Uh, I started off really well <laughs> with that huge buckle, but went downhill fast. <laughs> uh, let's look through junk. Uh, we got lead. We got a strip off a window catch, which I've just broke it to. <laughs> oh well. Um, I think they call that an impeller. It, it could be something off a drill. I'm not right sure. And then we got, that's got to be shrapnel off a bomb case, and so is that. Uh, this sort of looked a little bit interesting. I don't know whether it's uh, just a chunk of lead, if it's lead, or it's supposed to have a design. Ah, so that's all the day today. Uh, bronze ring there. I don't think it's a gasket. And then hey, what I thought was a button turned out to be a little washer. Another little washer. Oh dearie me. Like I said in the video, I, I, I went on to high power TX3. But it, it was just giving me loads and loads of little signals that didn't mean anything. So I went back to normal. Right. Let's have a look at the goodies. Look at that, first one I got, hey? I thought, whoa, whoa what a day I'm going to have today, but, <laughs> well, beautiful, big bronze buckle. 
massive thing. Brass probably, but same difference. And then another one, got another one. But that one, my goodness, that's much, much older buckle. And it's been in the wars as that one. I don't know, the, the power of, that must go on to these things sometimes. To just bend them out of shape. And look, nice little shield horse brass. Yes. At one time I would have thought these were brooches and things, but no, no, I know different now. It's got a, that's where the pin was there. Um, the soldering just, it just corrodes because the pins are different to the, the front piece. So it causes electrolysis, I believe, and just rots them off. <laughs> um, probably polished shiny bright and then just stuck onto the black leather. Would have, would have looked really nice. Now, coins. I got three. These are the size of half pennies. But, ah, uh, even, even corroded, they don't look right. Uh, they don't look to be bronze, they look to be copper, but hard to tell. So I'll, I'll just have to call them Vicky half pennies that have seen better days. Because <laughs> normally they come out beautiful, the Victorian half pennies. A 50p on the footpath. Cupra nickel junkite. Look at it. This is that is what it should look like. <laughs> Bright and shiny, 50 pence. Uh, absolute belter. But that's what they come out the ground like. Cupra nickel. <sighs> Enjoyed myself. <laughs> Still can't feel my toes. <laughs> Put the wrong pair of socks on, they kept creeping down into your boots. Oh my goodness, you can do without wet feet. <laughs> no socks. But it was fun. Nice to get out there. So, quite like it. Quite like a nice little horse brass and a couple of buckles. So, it's out there. Just got to go get it. <sighs> till I see you next time. If I live till next time. Because <laughs> I'm expecting it to snow. <laughs> See you later. Bye.